All right. This is automotive class one, whatever I've done already. Uh, we all know you got to change your oil every whatever your manufacturers recommend. Back in the day, it used to be 3,000 miles or three months, whichever came first, right? Well, I'm going to show you what happens when oil sits in an engine for a very, very long time. And it, it, got, it hasn't even hit the miles yet to do the oil change. Now, here on my 95 Sunfire, um, it's only got 39,000 miles. Uh, when I did the oil change, the next oil change due was at 42,890 miles. Um, it's way, it went way beyond the, molly, uh, the monthly change, right? We're talking about 15 years. So I'm going to turn the camera around. And you're going to see the mileage on the vehicle, the mileage on the, the sticker. Then I'm going to show you what the oil looks like when you don't do your oil changes when you're supposed to. Yes, I went over a long, long time. But remember, this car's been sitting. Um, I hardly ever started it up. And I'm going to show you what actually happens to oil when it sits. Okay, I'm going to turn it around. Okay. Let's see if you can see. It's only got 39,000 miles. 39 and a half, right? And then the sticker. I don't know if you can see. Can I get a good angle? Let me turn this off. I don't know if you can see. Maybe I should have did a light, right? Uh, okay, I just had it. Uh, it sucks. You know, maybe you can be like, get a better phone, right? There you go. 42. Okay, that was supposed to be the next oil change. Okay. I'm going to show you what exactly happens to the oil. Just from sitting. Okay. This is the oil. Look how black it is. If I put on a filter, filter's white. And look, so that's why you're supposed to change the oil whenever your manufacturer says, because it does turn black after sitting for such a long time. So for those of you that ignore your vehicles and don't do your oil change when you're supposed to, and you drive it every day, and you know, then you wonder why you have car problems, it's because you don't maintain your vehicle. I'm not saying that this will fix all your problems, but you always want to um, do your oil change when you're supposed to prevent, prevent, from damage is causing. So remember, this this oil has been sitting for 15 years. My car's only got 39 and a half thousand miles. Our next change, oil change, was supposed to be at 42, and this is exactly what happens. Oil turns black. Okay, so do your oil change when you're supposed to. When the manufacturer um, does it, and you know, and you're preventing, you're you're uh, preventing maintenance. You're preventing from future uh, damage into your vehicle. I'm not going to say this is going to make your motor last forever because a car is like a human being. It's unpredictable. It could run great today and tomorrow it just dies out. Next thing you know, you're caught in victory. So um, that's today's educational class. So I'll see you guys later. I okay, hope you guys, uh, this was helpful and useful and makes you think about your vehicle now.